This is IB. I'm here today to break down jump techniques to help increase your vertical because there's small things I'm going to pinpoint today that really could decrease your vertical severely that most people do. I was with my guy Kobe today. He's around 5'8-ish, maybe a 30-inch vertical. Uh, he's not the most consistent dunker, but the goal was to get him to become a consistent dunker, right? So to become a consistent dunker, you have to have a good base, and that's with anything in life. To build stability, you have to have a good base, right? To reach your goal, you got to have a good base. The first thing that I had to do to critique his jump technique was to observe it. I wanted to look at his jump technique as is before I add or take away something that he's doing or not doing, right? There's something called the penultimate step. It's the last step that you take before you gather and explode up. I want you guys to notice how his penultimate step is not deep enough. Um, at the end of his jump, I'm going to show you the demonstration that I gave him to help him out. So I want you guys to notice um, from point A to point B, from my example of how explosive and how deep I'm getting with my last step to my gather, right? And if we go back to Kobe, you'll notice that even though he's shorter than me and I am taller than him because I'm around 6'5", that still doesn't defeat the purpose of extending your last leg to make that jump explosive, right? So after completing the penultimate step to the gather, you want to make sure in motion that you're putting your body in a stacked position. So that's ankle, knees, hips, chest, right? You want to make sure you're swinging your arms back and then forth, right? You want to have a full motion. Having a full motion teaches your body a routine. Routine is basically muscle memory. So the main thing is keeping a good motion, right? Like I said, the muscle memory, right? You go from the penultimate step to the stacked body, to the explosive jump, right? You stay low, you explode up. So it's small things that you notice that people do to decrease their vertical. Okay, so let's take a few steps back, okay? Let me break this down for one and two foot jumpers, right? Take your penultimate step and you have to make sure once you place that foot down after you take your penultimate step, you want to make sure that you are stable and aligned. Do not tilt. That's going to take away so much vertical. You cannot to place your foot to a point where you can keep yourself up and not lean because leaning or tilting in any kind of way can decrease your vertical severely i promise you it's gravity you you have you have to have a center of mass you have to make sure that your body is aligned and after you get your body aligned after you have the penultimate step you want to swing your arms as far back as you can, and then you want to swing them upward as fast as you can, right? You want to make sure that you're using your whole body. Your arms can add at least one or two inches to your vertical just by using them correctly, right? So the fact of you using your whole body and you literally taking the time to be consistent and continue to have the same routine, the same routine, the same consistent uh, repetition, right? It creates the muscle memory to understand that your body can do this, right? It's all about being consistent, okay? It's not about how much weight you can lift or being the most athletic person in the world. It's small things that can help your vertical, right? So like I said, this is one of the breakdowns of how you can help increase your vertical. I just broke down a lot of stuff. Uh, I'm not going to give out too much information. If you really want to learn how to jump higher, you can uh, go to www.illbounce.com. Uh, we have a vert training program. We also have online coaching, a personal coach that can help you 24-7. Access at any time. You can contact me and I can help you out, break down your jumps, and uh, help you gain the bounce that you want. I uh, hope you guys like this video. Uh, for more videos like this, let me know. I can do stuff like this. But the goal today was to break down his jump. And a week or so from now, you know, we're going to get him to dunk. So that's the goal. But once again, I appreciate you guys. And I'm out.